It's also a big day for youth sports and also the area economy. They're having a ribbon cutting. I hope it's a red ribbon. And it's at, uh, well, less than four hours from now in Chesterfield at their new sports complex. Yeah, Fox 2's Laura Simon has a closer look at what's inside and what you can expect when you go there. Laura, good morning to you. Blair and John, good morning. I would anticipate it being a red ribbon too, but behind me is what's said to be the largest indoor volleyball and basketball sports complex here in the region. That all according to the Chesterfield Sports Association who runs this facility and it's estimated to bring in around 900,000 people to the area each year because of this new sports complex behind me. So ground officially broke on it back in August after experiencing a few delays because of of historic July flooding. It's a 97,000 square foot facility on Etherton, Etherton Road. A uh, thousand youth athletes are expected to practice here each week and 2,500 athletes are expected to play in tournaments on the weekends. Developers say this will be a major economic driver as it is expected to generate $3.6 million in annual local spending. Nearly 20 major regional and national sporting events, including martial arts and gymnastics meets, are already scheduled. It has nine basketball courts, which converts to 18 volleyball courts and they are equipped with Olympic level flooring. Other amenities include a fitness area, full food service operations and multi-purpose rooms for teams, meetings and classes. The general contractor on the project is Keystone Construction Company and the developer is Mia Rose Holdings. And the ribbon cutting for this new sports complex here in Chesterfield is set for nine this morning and it appears on their schedule that this is already mostly booked up for the rest of the year with various tournaments and events going on. For now, reporting live in Chesterfield, Laura Simon, Fox 2 News.